I don't use any grease. I use lube. I'll show you guys the lube in a little bit. Let's just clean this up since I've already opened it. It's actually pretty dirty. I just couldn't tell. Oh, wow, it's, it's dirty. Can't even, couldn't tell. I honestly don't care too much about this gear diff. It's not bad on the track. I just don't like that I have to do more maintenance. And then I use my chain lube, bicycle chain lube. It's a dry wax. Kyosho used to sell something like this for the kingpin. I used to use it for my uh, pinion and the spur. Mostly just the pinion and let it dry. Now I am using it for the gear diff. I use this in the uh, box stock uh, gear gear diff as well. It's just a drop. This part, the right rear drive side, you don't want to over tighten this. Or else you're going to push against those um, gears inside and the mesh wouldn't be right. The shiny bearing right there, until that's covered all the way. Yep. And then feel it. Uh, it feels like there's still a little bit of resistance there. So I'm gonna back out. Okay. I'm gonna run it on the track and see. I timed it I'm just a little bit. Yeah, this it's almost like it's dry inside, but it's it's not. I did put lube just for um, make it a little quiet and for wear and tear. Okay, should be good. This is what I've been using. The gear diff is not something I use all the time. I'm usually running the ball diff, but right now I am just beating up on the gear diff. But anyway, this is the new car that I built. Okay, that's it for this video. Thanks.